grand rising each and every one of you guys thank you for joining me this morning i hope that you are doing great and that your day is going well so far the lord led me to joel 2 and 25 it says so i will restore to you the years that the swarming lotus has eaten the crawling lotus the consuming lotus and the chewing lotus my great army which I sent among you, you shall eat in plenty and be satisfied and praise the name of the Lord, your God, who has dealt wondrously with you and my people shall never be put to shame. Did you hear that? See, things happen and life happens, but there are things that happen that shouldn't happen. But the Lord is saying he's restoring those things that your enemies Anyone have talked about you, taken things from you, been a burden to you, whatever they've done to you that was wrong. He's getting ready to restore you in this day and in this season. Restoration is the word that I was hearing. He's restoring to you the things that that was lost. Everything that you lost in life is coming back to you. You shall not be put to shame. He's ready to restore you. Okay? So let's go ahead and pray. Dear Heavenly Father, we thank you so much for this morning. We thank you for waking us up today. We thank you for having us to be here and being able to pray together. You said where two or more are gathered in your name, that you would be in the midst. And so we are here together, Lord God. Lord, we know that you have are ready to restore all of the things that the lotus has eaten that has been taken from us rightfully and unrightfully because you are a just god and we thank you for that lord we come here today asking for your healing that you would heal us from the top of our heads to the soles of our feet that you would restore our body our mind soul and our spirit that you would open our eyes to see the things that we need to see, Lord God. We ask that you would cover us every single day, especially this day. Keep us covered. Allow your mighty warning and guarding angels to be with us, to fight off any type of attacks that may come our way. Lord, we thank you that you've already started this day off right because we started it with you. Each and every morning, we're starting it off with you because you are first. Lord, we thank you. Lord, anyone who's going through any type of depression, any type of abuse, physical or emotional, any type of bipolar, anything that is going on with the mental issues, Father God, we ask that you would touch them and help them to be healed. Release your anointing and your power to help them to be more at peace. Give us peace that surpasses all understanding, Lord God. Lord, some people feel as though that they are being tortured by any type of demons or demonic realm. We're asking that you would protect us from that. Create a hedge of protection around us, around our minds, around our hearts, around our entire body, around our homes, cars, trucks, and lands, and all of our family friends, and loved ones. Lord, we thank thank you for the things that you have given us, all of the things that you have allowed us to keep. But we also ask that you would make the enemy give back what he has stolen from us, uprooted out of his kingdom, and move it back to us, Give it, make him give it back to us right now, and cause our blessings to come flowing, pressed down, shaken together, overflowing, Lord God. Lord, open up your open up our hearts. Also, whatever doors have been shut or any blockages that have been placed up on our um, money and our materials, our homes, any blockages um, that are over any of those that are watching this video, any blockages that have been in our children or in our families' life, Lord God, we ask that you would open up those blockages and cause the enemy to give back what he has stolen from us. Lord, cover us now. 
open our ears to hear what you have to say to us and not that of a stranger. Open our eyes, Father God. Help us to see. Help us to remember our dreams that we need to remember, Father God. And those that are not from you, Father God, we ask that you remove those things and cause them to be null and void. Pour out your anointing now so that the healing can continue to take place. Let it continue to overflow and be filled within us and all around us, Father God. You ask me to come here each morning to pray for healing. And this is what I'm here to do. And Father God, as we are obedient to do this, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for allowing us to be able to do so. Lord, we thank you for all the things that you've done in our lives. All of the things that you've given us, but also thank you for protecting us from the things that we shouldn't have. Thank you for, thank you for, even though delayed does not mean denied that it is coming to us because you are restoring us. And thank you now for your restoration. We thank you for all of this, Lord God. And we thank you for you, the Holy Spirit. And we thank you for Jesus. Fill us with your Holy Spirit that we may not sin against you. Forgive us of our sins and cleanse us of all unrighteousness. These things we ask in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, Yeshua HaMashiach, we pray. Amen. Amen and amen. Once again, thank you so much for joining me in this prayer. I thank you for (laughs) clicking on the video. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And let all your friends know about this prayer because they may need a touch from God as well. Thank you.